Hi guys, uh, my name is Jordan and my boss is actually over there. <laughs> so I really have to think about what I should say. <laughs> oh, it's okay, so you can stay. I, I'll talk about all the good things. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> of course, there's no bad thing. Uh, <laughs> this is so bad. Anything else, you can either come and talk to you later. Okay. <laughs> and then, I assume all of you guys are students and probably you want to you might want to find an internship like this, uh, working in a startup, and I'm going to share my experience in a bit. Like, okay, so this is me in the office pretending to be working, and then this is every client and uh, device. So uh, let me explain a little bit. So we actually make use of a machine learning algorithm to integrate this uh, this electronic device with the. Uh, AC at your home or any environment that you want to want it to be, you make make use of it to uh, give every user a personalized best environment. So I'm in the team of machine learning, uh, yeah, artificial intelligence. And then okay, this I talk about. And then it all started in May. I attended a career day. Like I probably you guys did, but I. I was actually exploring, like this I was interested in okay, finding out what, what the startups today, what they are doing and, and I didn't know there was an interview, there was a speed interview and then my mentor asked me to sit down and then talk to me a little bit and gave me a great reason. I was like, oh, okay. But I managed to solve it at last and yeah, I was very lucky. And then yeah, this is the period that I worked for. And then one thing that I... Uh, the things that I really get from this in internship is passion, curiosity, curiosity, and willingness to learn. Because machine learning algorithm for your information is really not easy. Like, uh, it takes a lot of challenges. Like, uh, you just have to learn it from time to time. You, do, you can't just take one big step to uh, just jump over that, that thing. And then, uh, one of the things that I want to talk about startup internship is just, okay. Uh, this is my example. My many of my friends they they fancy working in a big companies. They probably think like, okay, working in a probably you interning in a big companies you boost your CV a lot, and that's actually uh, perhaps it's true. But I think I still suggest people to go for small companies because if you go to a big company and you work you work there, you are just a very tiny part of the big machine and you're not really learning anything. Uh, probably you do, but just, I think startup companies, they, they can give you more if you want to learn. Just like, okay, just for example, startup companies are normally small, and then they, just because they are, they are small, they don't have extra, they don't really have extra budget to hire someone extra, like, okay, hire someone, uh, hire an intern that's not doing any work. But big companies, they, just for the sake of giving up internship, they, because I heard, I heard a lot from my friends that they went into big companies but they are not doing something very really productive for it. Probably they are just doing data entry some stuff like that. But what I, what I did in this uh, MB Climate is really about uh, real life application. I really put what I learned. Uh, yeah, for your information, I'm from HKU and I study imaging, uh, computing and data analytics. And so this, this is really a perfect a uh, perfect place for me to get my hands dirty, deal with all the raw data, and just yeah, just analyze the data and do a lot of programming. So this is what I do. I do machine learning research, statistical computing, Python script writing. I, and I doubt if big companies can give you tasks like this, because they are they probably afraid like, okay, you're just a student, you, are, you probably can't do anything. Uh, you can't do much, and they are not really they are probably not willing to teach you much because they know you are, you are probably by the end of the summer you are just you'll be gone. So, and what what have I learned? The first thing is really about today's start is tomorrow technology is breakthrough. Like I I believe all of you guys are uh, at least all most of you guys believe in this because uh, I think that's the reason that you come here today. You come here and then you have some curiosity and stuff. And yeah, to be fair, most technological, uh, technological startups, uh, no, breakthroughs today in the world, around the world, they are 
they all come from these stars, small little little stars. And yeah, for example, MB Climate is doing something, uh, creating a, a personalized climate for every user, and that's something very amazing. Nobody has thought about it before. And then, yeah, and then uh, it's also about the passion of creating value. And you know, whatever you are doing today, just make an impact for the society. And stops, they have this value because they want to create something. And especially, uh, I, I'm an engineer. We love to create something and want people to make use of it. And we just, uh, yeah, probably money is not that important. I think, like for for me myself, I think the joy and the satisfaction of doing my work is just really great. Not because my boss is there, and <laughs> yeah, it's it's really because I. I feel I'm very really satisfied with what I've done and I feel like I I learned a lot. Of course I didn't know a lot of stuff at, in the beginning. My hand my mentor used to have a hard time. And yeah, and then some deep deep technical experience because yeah, my mentor really taught me a lot and some problem solving skills. Because it's just uh, uh, it's free and easy like my mentor gave me the data, he gave me some some suggested approaches, but I have to analyze the problem myself, and that's really tough. Like sometimes I get stuck a little bit, and yeah, you just have to yeah, be. Yeah. And then another one is team working spirit. I I feel like every company is really a, uh, they really have a good working atmosphere. I really enjoy a lot a lot of the stuff. Sometimes occasionally they they will tend to have some company lunch once at least once a month. Like but those lunches are for celebrating someone's birthday or some anniversary working there, and then and then they we also have a live chat, a uh, coffee chat, and then we sometimes we we chat inside. Uh, it's it's something like uh, a messenger that you can talk to your colleagues, and then they chat a lot inside, and then they make some funny jokes. And although I didn't really participate. I'm still watching and <laughs> yeah, it's some of the stuff is just really funny. And then most memorable things, uh, first of all, is of course my mentor's guidance and teaching, because he has been very patient and he gave me a lot of guidance. He, yeah, I think he also told me before he used to be the best tutor in HKUST before he he worked in uh, MB Climate. And, yeah. And then he always encouraged me, like, don't worry about it, just, you know, just keep on trying it. And then he never scold me, although I'm very stupid. <laughs> yeah. Occasional birthday celebration, uh, this one I talked about, and best working atmosphere, yeah. And then real exposure to data science. Yeah, I'm a data data analytics student, so I really have, I think most of the times when I, uh, when I do data, I just do a bit in school. I don't practice it a lot. I don't get the real chance of getting some data, some data and then just analyze it. But this is really a good chance if you really get the experience of working in a real industry. So, yeah. And then we also have daily staff meeting. And uh, this is something every day at noon, 12, 12 o'clock, everybody, everybody will just okay, go to the meeting room and then stand around a circle and then they will talk about the stuff they are doing today. And then, you know, the kind of feeling of working there is also like, I feel like I'm a real engineer. When people look at me, when all the colleagues look at me, they, I feel like they regard me as an engineer, not, not like, oh, you're just an intern, then they look down on you, and, you know. And then, they probably do, but, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> That's my own impression. And this is my office, and, yeah, and then this is the daily meeting. And then this is one of the coffee lunch. The picture is very good. And then uh, this is rice conference. Uh, this is one of the, uh, not one of the, this is the Asia's largest uh, sound conference. And my my boss actually won the teaching yeah, uh, competition. Oh, many, many stocks. And then this is one of the, uh, some data graphs that I took. And then, yeah, this is the end of my 
share again. I really want to encourage you guys not, uh, not to fall into the trap to judge a company by the company size. We really have to appreciate the existence of these staffs, small staffs today, because they they can shine one day later. You might not know you. You really have to admire their uh, their persistence and their 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 courage to try things out. Thank you.